Oh yeah. No one else gave a shit about the arts in high school. Bro, yeah. So then they graduate high school. Yeah. And then it's not that they didn't have friends, it's just that people didn't understand them, I think. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Well, yeah. well that's, that's why, like, like a lot of, like, arts, but it's so funny, because, like, like, oh, this might be before your time, Henry, but do you know the whole emo notion? Do yeah. You know what emo is? There's a lot of angsty kids there. Yeah, really yeah. angsty, right? Oh my god, super angsty. Like, what are they so angsty about, though? I know. You know what I mean, right? right? I know exactly what you mean. It's just... Wait, so why are they so angsty? It's just... I don't know. Is, cool is it cool to be angsty, or what? I think it is. I don't understand it, though. It's something that I just... It's definitely prevalent. Yeah. Especially in the fine arts majors. Oh, yeah, yeah. You know, yeah. those are like... How dark and depressing can I make this man? This is actually not cool to be happy anymore. Yeah, I know. Have you ever met like a happy art student? Uh, no, it's always the uh, starving, depressed part. Yeah, right? I'm just like, what's the last time you've met, I mean, like, besides you and Sebastian, I don't know any, any other art students who are actually like healthy and fit? Yeah, um, there's not, it's a select group of people. Yeah. I think a lot of um, the ID department. Yes. Uh, I don't know if the right word is normal isn't the right word, but uh, it's a uh, not not emaciated. Yeah. Yeah, I think um not 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 sickly looking. Yes. <laughs> I think it's just a more um, in tune population of students yeah. with the world rather than with themselves. I can't really blame the other major. I understand why, uh, you know, painting majors or sculpture majors or textile majors, they kind of have their own world. Yeah. And that's I mean, I mean that's cool too, but then like, I don't know, I feel like artists, it's, it's good to like, do bar ballad where you do have your crazy imagination world, but certainly at the end of the day, one should also be connected to like, embodied flesh-based reality. Yeah. I also think that artists, I do not know where the emo artists came from, <laughs> but the, uh, it's strange to me because historically, yep. artists, specifically like in Paris, yep. Picasso and Brock and you know Brancusi and all these guys, yeah. they were massive socialites. Yeah, yeah, yeah all that's true. Yeah, yeah. Show up to clubs. Oh yeah, like, like even Dali, right? Yeah, they would sit in cafes and they would, you know, go see shows and talk yeah. and be social. Yeah, yeah, all that's a good point, huh? Yeah. And then crazy. suddenly they became all like fucking oh, weird. Yo, what's up, baby? Looking small. Hey, have you met my homeboy uh, Jamal? Okay, Henry. Nice to meet you, man. Henry Ford, man. <laughs> do you know? Do you know how you know Henry is the real deal? He wears a Seiko, he doesn't wear a Rolex. <laughs> really? <laughs> what, what you hitting, Jamal? Hit some deadlifts, bro. Oh, you hit some deadlifts? Yeah, it's you, you want You want to tap this? Uh, yeah. Wait. It'd be nice to have some uh, weights in here that are for deadlifts, wouldn't it? That's what I'm saying, right? But then, you know, I've been, I've been fucking with it. Essentially, just uh, this setup here, I've discovered to be the optimal setup to just Get your, get your reps in and, cause actually, uh, Henry, guess what, my PR is on my deadlift. Hmm. You wanna guess? No, I don't. Just guess, throw out a number. PR? Uh, Personal record. I don't deadlift, so I don't, I don't even have a gauge to put that on. Four, 455 pounds. Just go on YouTube, search Eric Kim Sumo deadlift. I actually have a video of me at the Nelson. <laughs> Alright, I'm, I'm gonna see you guys in a second. I just need to go upstairs real quick.